Hello everyone, this is me, Satya here, and I'm back with the remaining month of November reads, start from the 22nd through the 30th of November 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of Leo. So Leos, let's see what's coming in for you for this uh, remaining month time. I will be adding a lot many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned. And before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading, Hitman, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest for personal reads. You can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer. So, yeah, Leos. We have four of wands, eight of cups, and the devil. <clears throat> I really see somebody is taking steps towards what they want. And it can be probably the person that you are dealing with. If they have been controlled by people in their life, I really feel like, you know, they're choosing to choose you over all and everything and taking action towards you. So for those of you who have been on the waiting side for a person to reach out to you, to communicate to you, to open up about their feelings to you, and they were hiding it because they felt like, you know, the family might not approve, the friends might not approve or this and that. I really feel like you know, they are going to break free from the control of other people in their life and take action towards you. Now for those of you who in in, in you know for those of you who are you know uh, dealing with the you know family issues uh yourself I feel like you know it's gonna be you taking action towards what you want. Um getting rid of the you know pressure of the family and doing what you feel is right. So I really see something like that is coming up for you during this remaining month time where probably you or the person that you're dealing with is going to take action towards you or you are going to take action towards the one that you love because um, you really don't want to stay in control of other people. You want to choose for yourself and you want to kind of like, you know, take action to the one that you love because you really believe that, you know, you are going to get the happiness that you want with that specific someone. So for some of you, it may be you who's going to take action towards a person that you love, that you want to be with, that you want to probably settle down with, or it can be the person that you are dealing with is going to take action towards you believing the same now i really feel like you know there is a lot of um <clears throat> there's a lot of um i really feel like you know um uh, opposition around this connection it can be coming from your family too maybe you both you know want this connection but the families are not approving if, uh, uh, of it and you're waiting you might have been waiting for things to work out so the two of you could come together maybe you wanted to your person wanted to but then there are restrictions for some of you there could be some religion related issues as well which is the reason why you kind of like you know still not together yet but i really feel like you know this remaining month time is going to be the time where you both are going to break free from the you know the restrictions and you know all those negativity or opposition coming for this connection and you're gonna take action towards each other so i really feel like you know for majority of you you and this person whoever it is that you're dealing with you are going to come closer you are going to break free from the limitations and restrictions and you're going to come together because you love each other so i really see that movement coming for you in this uh, remaining month time and i feel like you know for those of you if your person has been holding themselves back uh, and you know we're not ready to you know um, express their love they will be doing that during this remaining month time so if you are completely single there might be somebody who has been having feelings for you but they have been holding back again maybe because of the same reason maybe they felt like you know it's gonna be a tough connection to pursue uh, for the same reasons but uh, they will be opening up about their feelings to you. So some movement ahead is definitely coming up. And I really feel like, you know, for a majority of you, this movement that I see coming with this person, um, this this person and the connection that you are going to have with them is going to be long term. It's not going to be like, you know, boyfriend-girlfriend situation and, you know, nothing move forward. I feel like you know, it's going to be more of a committed relationship, which is going to lead towards marriage for a majority of you. So I really feel like, you know, somebody is acknowledging the love and the connection uh, that they feel towards you or you are going to be acknowledging that love and feeling for a first a specific person uh, yourself so you might be the one taking action and now uh, you know I, I really see you with the one during this remaining month time um, you and this person have uh, always had a very beautiful connection but yes it was hard for the two of you to make a decision about this connection because of the other people's involvement so i really feel like you know this this uh, remaining month is going to change all and everything i really feel like you know you both are going to be like 
uh, maturely handling the situation and take action towards each other. Let's see what else is coming in for you for this remaining month time of November. <clears throat> Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. So for some of you, maybe the two of you are holding back because of the family and situations like that. But now is the time and this person is not going to be like holding themselves back and they would want to kind of like you know, take action towards you. So something is definitely coming for you. Uh, it can be a past scenario um, where a person is coming, returning back to you, choosing you, leaving all and everything for you. If they left you for other things, their family, work, finances, whatever the case may be. But they really want to take action back towards you. So somebody from the past is definitely returning with a commitment to offer is what I'm picking up. Let's see more message. What else is coming in? This is your soulmate. Wow. So I feel like you know, for the majority of you, you are definitely going to be with your soulmate during this uh, remaining month time because... This person and you are destined to be together, whether it's a past person or whether if it's a new person. I really feel like, you know, there has been some issues between the two of you because of other people. And, um, you know, these people can be their family. These people can be their, you know, people from their religion. Uh, these people can be somebody that uh, probably they are working for. Uh, and their work might have been the reason why the two of you were not together. But I really see major reconciliation taking place for you in this uh, uh, remaining month time. And this is, you know, your soulmate. With this card as well, you do have that same energy. You know, you feel at home with each other. There is a lot of comfort that uh, you feel being with each other. And I feel like, you know, the, the chemistry that you share is uh, matchless. And which could be the reason why the two of you are coming stronger than ever back to each other. And I feel like, you know, your, your connection is very strong. Uh, maybe you had a time apart from each other, but it was never the case that you forgot them or they forgot you and you know the two of you were moving on from each other to another person i feel like you know you have been mentally physically emotionally still attached to each other which i believe is the reason why the two of you are coming back together stronger than that you know stronger than ever for a coveted relationship for a happy fulfilling married life maybe so yeah let's see what else is coming in inspiration being prepared as you will soon receive a visit from a fairy of inspiration Come dusk or dawn, she can call it any time. I feel like the divine really wants you to get inspired right now uh, with probably the ideas that you're having because there, there might be some sort of inspiration coming from the uh, divine around uh, this connection probably or otherwise as well. So be prepared to get inspired. There is, there is uh, some ideas and some divine guidance coming around for you for your love life scenario or for your work life scenario as well. So let's see more cards. Uh, Protection. The fairies of protections are shielding you with a magical fairy ring of love and light. Practice psychic protection before embarking upon any spiritual work. Um, I feel like it's very important right now for you to make sure that whatever you're choosing to do in this remaining month time, you stay protected. Um, especially when you're manifesting something, make sure that your energies are protected and your energies of your uh, you know, what you're creating is also protected. So make sure that you don't share things out with people who are not having good intentions for you. So protect yourself, protect your relationships. And uh, I really feel like, you know, there is a lot of divine help coming up for you to create the life that you desire. And uh, <clears throat> which is the reason why you are definitely manifesting a reconciliation with a specific someone. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, remaining month of uh, November time. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care and bye.